what's going on y'all today we got the yeezy pk pirate black god version this has been rumored to be the best thing since sliced bread first thing i noticed the box is perfect it is immaculate it is exactly like the box that i got when i ordered mine from adidas.com when i got through luckily this box is freaking perfect uh, everything from the back to the tag and everything. This looks exactly like it came from adidas.com actually. Um, so let's get right into it. Open this thing up and see what we got. Boom. There you have it. Paper. Let's go ahead. Check these things out. Let's do the left. So, bam. This is the God version in all of his glory. Finally. First impressions. These look good. These look just like the ones from Adidas.com. Let's go over a couple things here. Let's the first thing, um, the front, let's look at the front. You know, the, the version one, uh, 350s have that, that curve on all of them. Now I don't have the shoe trees in here, which I was supposed to get some before I did this, but I forgot. So we'll just have to make do, you know, I was trying to do that. So it shows more of the curve, but forget all that. Let's take a look. So this is what they look like in, from straight on. Pattern looks great. I mean, look at the pattern. The pattern, the pattern, I mean, the other version they had didn't look like this exactly. It was close, but a few things were off. Let's check out this suede patch here. Let's see if I can get in nice and close. The, the cut on it is very accurate, like precision, like a been laser cut. You can see the stitching up here, which is important because you can see that in the retail pair. Um, the heel tab. Look at that heel tab from the bird's eye view or drone view. That's looking pretty good. You know, give it a little, a little tug. So it should be open like that. And it's pretty much like that on its own. You can see all the dots in there. I know a lot of you count. Make sure there's X amount of dots in there. Man, these, dang. Even the laces are definitely on point. I don't remember what they were uh, on the other pair. Now, for anybody asking about the stitching here, these were on the on the are uh, they are on the retail as well. I don't know if it's there's light in here. You can see it a little bit. And it should be, yeah, it's one on this side too. Um, I don't think it stands out. Um, yeah, it just depends on which way you look at it. See, like that, you can like, oh man, I can see that from up. And then like this, it disappears. So yeah, it's the same, same as the retail pair. Um, let's check out the insole real quick. Paper here. Boom. And so it's always been an issue sometimes with these Yeezys. Let's take a look. And oh my. Pattern goes up like it's supposed to. Doesn't stop right here. That wall looks like they fixed that. Oh, even this. This is even really flat now. This is really. Huh. Flat. Remember the other ones were. Like the V2s, they were a little bubbly. 
but these are actually more flat and I haven't worn these or nothing like that so um, it hasn't flattened on the you know I haven't done anything they li literally just came in a few hours ago the sizes on here are accurate 10 through uh, 11 this is a 10 and a half and so it looks good pattern looks good the texture oh and look at this you can't see that like like sometimes you can see a little square there um but i'm not sure if all of those the retails are like that either but yeah this is it's just like they stamp these right on just like adidas stamped them on which looks good the pattern the direction the pattern is going everything looks good inside of the shoe you know you always got that sh that line there on the retail pair stitching in there here got the the little texture suede up here i would say these are these are a go these are a go i wish i had the other pair that they did on me um as for the retail pair those are on the way so i had to i didn't want to wait have you guys wait so i just figured i'd do like an unboxing first and then when the retail pair comes in i'll do another video of showing you know side by side but so far these look good let's oh the bottom we gotta look at the bottom got to look at that bottom all right that boost, the crinklies are there, little nips are all there, the softness is there. They always had the boost right as far as comfort, like feel. These look, these look good. Um, let's see if I can get a nice angle on them. These look good. Let's put this back in there. Um, size tag. Yeah, everything is what it normally is. You probably can't see that. But let me see. There you go, a little bit. All the numbers in there. So these, these are straight. Um, Mm, let's take a look at these. Tag on the right shoe as normal. Let me uh, focus on that. There you go. And we got the easy. Let's take a look at this pattern here. See me focusing on that. Give you guys a good look. Yeah, that's the reflection from the light. It's really not that shiny. It's really dark like this. All right. What do you guys think? Now, it is a lot of light in here. So, uh, hopefully that doesn't look too different by the time I upload this. I know YouTube compresses the crap out of videos. But man, these, hey, in person, in hand, these are definitely better than the previous version. Um, I've seen them on the site. Let's look at the back. Oh, you already looked at the heel tab, but the pattern on the back, it's a little crazy, but the pattern, which you know, it's not supposed to be going straight across anyway. It's supposed to be a little wild like that. Hey man, these definitely are decent. These are definitely better than what it was. So if you plan on getting a pair of Pirate Blacks, definitely check to see if they got your size in stock. It's another thing. Um, this is what I always do is I always check to see if my size is in stock first because I've seen a lot of people complain, hey, it's taking forever, blah, blah, blah. Well, that's probably because you just, you know, straight up order, which is fine. But if they don't have your size in stock, you're going to have to wait. So they got to make sure that, you know, they got to get your size in stock. Then they then they ship it. Um, so that's why I always just send uh, Kim and them an email 
and just to check to see if my size is in stock first. And if it is, then I go ahead and order them. That way I know, you know, the average time that they, the shipping is supposed to arrive is, is basically on schedule. But when they don't have your size, you gotta, you know, check and wait on that. Then you gotta wait for the shipping. So that tends to be long. I don't think a lot of people understand that um, because normally, you know, you go on a website, you just order or whatever. and just. But, you know, it's a little different when you're doing something from overseas. You got to uh, cross your T's and dot your I's before you, uh, you know, proceed. At least that's what I do. You know what I'm saying? And I've always got my stuff on time. Um, just the first V2, the Beluga, was, it took a few weeks, but got everything uh, perfect. Everything was in perfect condition. And everything else was, uh, has been way sooner, just like these. So yeah, this is a nice little quick overview of unboxing. Like I said, once I get the retail pair in, I'll go ahead and um, upload another vid showing these side by side. So far, just looking at these and I've had a few retails already. I just didn't keep them, kept them for a little while and then just ended up letting them go. But um, I still got a king memory of what you know they look like. I took a couple pictures when I had them and all that good stuff. So I'll be comparing those. Um, but yeah, so far right now, off my memory, these, man, hey, these are it. I know a lot of the V2s are coming out now, you know, the, the newer colors or whatever, but you can't go wrong with the first classic. You know what I'm saying? Most people who have these are all beat up now anyway. The boost is like burnt black, it looks terrible. Nothing like getting a fresh pair, you know, hit PK up and um, keep these in the rotation. See you guys on the next one. Peace.